Okay. And we're on. So. All right, we're going to start with uh, do gentle warm ups here, lifting the chin up and down. Okay, side to side. All right, shoulders. Okay, bringing the arms up and just gently pull to one side. And to the other side. Okay, we'll take the hands to the back, clasp the hands behind you, and lift upward. Okay, good. Gently open the shoulders, shoulder chest junction. And reverse. our fingers interlock so that we can circle the wrists. And reverse. Stretch out to the front. We're gonna pulse three times to each side. So turn one, two, three, one, two, three. Okay, now we're gonna press up. We're gonna arch the back three pulses. One, two, three, down. One, two, three. One, two, three. One, two, three. And one, two, three. One, two, three. Yeah, very nice. Okay, circle the hips. In the other direction. Okay, turning the weights, letting the arms swing freely. Keep the knees unlocked. Okay, generate the twist by alternating pushing between your feet. Turn the weights. Nice and relaxed. Okay, today we're going to bring it up above the shoulder. So bring it up. We'll have one arm with the hand, the back of the palm, wrapping over the kidney on each side. Okay, then coming up, tapping the upper back, the middle of the upper back, and relax. Okay, 
Let's rub the palms together. We'll bring the feet in closer to one another so we can circle the knees. And reverse direction. Excellent. Okay, forward bend. Lift the hands up and stretching down. Relax, hold the stretch for a few counts. Turn to one side about 45 degrees. Take a nice deep breath. Back across the center to the other side. Nice deep breath. Return to the center, come on up. And relax, good. Okay, separate back out to uh, shoulder width. Okay, padding in the bagua shape. On the end of the body. Flapping the wrists. Fingers and wrists relaxed. All right, good. Okay, <clears throat> so we're going to do our uh, three meridian channel uh, tracing or visualization. So first starting on the inner corner of the ear, looping over the ear, down across the shoulder, down the arm, and out through the second finger, okay? So that's done on both sides. So visualize and relax along the pathway that you're tracing with your mind, okay? Front side of the ear, over the ear, down along the shoulder and arm, out through the second ear. Second pathway starting here, just on the inside corner of the eye, going down the front of the face bilaterally, across the front span of the body, down the front legs, down, out through the feet, and out through the second toe. Mindfulness of the front span of the body, relaxing down through the front span of the body. Connecting top to bottom, connecting yang and yin, lengthwise through the body. And then 
the back side of the body. We start on the inner corner of the eyes, come up over the crown of the head, down bilaterally along the outer side of the spine on either side, down through the back of the legs, down through the foot and out through the second toe. So again here, inner corner of the eyebrows, visualize coming up, down, down, down the back and out through the second toe. Take a few, take a moment to trace that pathway. Breathing comfortably as you do so, touching the tongue to the roof of the mouth. Emptying the mind. So for our Qigong exercises today, I'm going to introduce the new one for you here. So we're going to step out with the left leg to shoulder width. Now this one is done from a wider stance, more of a horse stance. So we're going to turn the right toe out and the right heel, turn the left toe out and the left heel. So we get a slightly wider stance, okay? We're going to bring the left hand up to the front, the right hand just above the crown of the head. going to sink slightly, bring the hand by the hip while the other one pulls back, relaxing the wrist. Relaxing the wrist, the waist turn generates the movement of the arm, relaxing the wrist, come out from the center with the bottom yang, uh, uh, yang facing palm, yin facing palm over top. Shoulders relaxed, wrists relaxed. As always. The internal body leads and mirrors the movement of the external, of the outside body. So slight rising with the extending hand, pulling with the upper hand. The pulling motion governed by the waist. So just go ahead, use this chance to become familiar with the movement. At no point you have one arm or hand still or waiting. And if one arm, one hand moves, the other does as well. Governed by the weights. Breathing to the Tantian.
couple more on each side. Okay, and relax. Bring the two together. All right? So as is the case sometimes with some of these exercises, the external movement may seem simple. Um, but as you go forward, you start to be able to become aware of and explore some of the nuances, some of the internal nuances, some of the way that the, the core of the body is generating movement, how uh, the core of the body, the waist, uh, is connected to the, the floor or the earth, okay? So with more practice, you'll start to see how you're generating these internal, internal circles of the body, okay, that generate the movement. So it's not just like you're doing a swim stroke here, right? It's always complete internal lead movement, okay? All right, so let's go through the series, okay? We're gonna go through the series of Wudong movements. Okay, three breaths. Inhale, palms facing inside, coming down, turning the fingers inward and out through the body. Right, right. And inhale. Arms coming together. Exhale down. Third, inhale. Okay, step out to your left. First, inhale, exhale. Inhale, exhale. One. comes over. Three breaths. Four. 
Step out left. Palms in. Round to the back and out to the front. Push up. Open. Exhale, low. One. Steps out. Up, push the long one points forward. Open to the rear. Palms up, out to the front. Inhale, turn palms. Exhale.
Foot steps out, shoulder width, hands take position, one palm up top, this is my right hand, left hand on the bottom.
Step the left foot out. Right toes turn out, right heel. Left toes turn out, left heel. Just be with self for a moment. And try to be aware of how the movement practice experiences now in, in stillness. Isn't that just wonderful? Yes. So thanks for joining everybody. All right. Have a great weekend. Thank you. Try to do something nice outside if we have some nice weather. Maybe go find a nice spot somewhere with a cool breeze, nice gentle flowing water, and do some qigong. <laughs> All right. Yeah. All right. Love you guys. Take care. Thank you. Bye. -bye. <laughs>